Christina, we've just heard the Archbishop speak at Synod, and it sounded very good. Do you think he can deliver? Well, I think it was a typical statement by the Archbishop of Canterbury. It was uh, nuanced. It was a plea for reconciliation for all of us to behave in, with integrity, with Christian integrity. I think he was talking about competing goods. And I think uh, the question is, is that um, how can we go forward uh, with as much unity as possible uh, in, a con in the context where we have decided to have women as bishops and we have decided that that is the greater good. And realistically, can women be ordained bishops without losing huge numbers from the conservative and the traditional wings of the church? Absolutely. We know that's possible. We know that most people either can't wait to see women as bishops or would accept them. And there will be very, very few people who feel that once with the Church of England has bishops, they cannot stay. The thing is, is that this, we've been debating it for years, and so, so this, people will have had a lot of time to think about what they do now. But why are you so opposed to some kind of structural arrangement? If you change the structures in order to have women as bishops, you change the nature of the episcopate and add a stroke you ensure that all bishops who are women are second-class bishops. Thanks, Christina.